racing go karts to raise money to help local kids, specifically Boy Scouts with the Dan Beard Council. That's what's happening in Claremont County, and it wouldn't be possible without the help of police departments around the tri-state, including the CPD. So the question is, are you guys going to win? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of like Talladega Nights. If you're not first, you're last. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that was Officer Michael Winslow from the Cincinnati Police Department. He's one of many from more than a dozen law enforcement teams competing in the two day Southwest Ohio Pursuit Law Enforcement race. Look at them go. It works like this. Individuals and corporate donors sponsor the police teams all to help thousands of Boy Scouts here. This really is an act of kindness on multiple levels. Just listen. We will raise in excess of $70,000 that are redirected and reinvested right back into outdoor adventure programs, teaching area kids uh, leadership skills, character uh, in the out of doors, even in a time like today when we're all combating uh, the pandemic, scouting is alive and well. It's always having a good, good community relations with our uh, people out in the street in different communities, but I think in this day and age, and right now you're 2020, you've got COVID-19, we all know about the civil unrest, and I think it's important that we're, to know that we're ultimately all in this together. You know, um, I think it helps to know that there are civilians out here that have our back and appreciate us, and you know, we're human beings like everyone else. All those officers were enjoying go-kart racing for a good cause, as we said, young people in the area. Shout out to everyone involved in this act of kindness.